mimi Mwai Kibaki na hapa kwamba Emilio Stanley Mwai Kibaki was born on 15th November 1931 in Gatuyani village Odaya in present day Nyeri County. Kibaki worked as a lecturer at Makerere University in Uganda. Kibaki Ukeme na wananchi wa Kenya. Kibaki returned to Kenya to become Kano's executive officer and help draft Kenya's independence constitution. In 1962 Kibaki was elected the member of parliament for Donom constituency present day Makadara subsequently he was appointed assistant minister for finance and chairman of the economic planning commission in 1963 he played a key role in drafting the famous 1965 sessional paper number no. 10 on african socialism and its application to planning in Kenya he will be promoted to become minister for commerce and industry in 1966 and later minister for finance and economic planning in 1969 after he was re-elected to parliament to represent Donom constituency that we shall have to divert a very significant proportion of our resources towards expenditures for defense and thus this this means that we will not be spending as much as we would like to do on uh, uh, other economic services He was overwhelmingly elected of the member of parliament in 1974 getting re-elected to parliament in 1979 1983 1988 1992 1997 2002 and 2007 when Daniel Arap Moi succeeded Jomo Kenyatta as country's president in 1972 Kibaki was named Kenya's vice president but retained his position as finance minister He was moved to the Ministry of Home Affairs in 1982. A fallout with President Moi in March 1988 saw Kibaki demoted from the vice presidency and moved to the Ministry of Health as minister. Despite the fallout with Moi, Kibaki would remain loyal to the president and the ruling party Kanu, and it came as a surprise for many when he resigned from government in December 1991. Days after the repeal of section 2A of the constitution which restored multipartism in Kenya his resignation would then see him form the Democratic Party DP with which he used to vie for presidency 1992 against Moi Kenneth Matiba and Jaramogi Oginga Odinga Kibaki came in third he ran for presidency again in 1997 this time round finishing second behind Moi and becoming the leader of the official opposition in 1998 Mwai Kibaki will give the presidency another shot in 2002 this time around boosted by a host of other opposition parties under the National Rainbow Alliance and through to the saying third time is the charm on 27 December 2007 Kibaki and NAC registered a landslide victory over Kanu with 62% of the votes compared to his competitor Huru Kenyatta's 31%. Hao tutatimiza hakuna mambo ambayo hatuwezi kutimiza. The win brought an end to Kanu's four decades rule since independence. Kibaki got re-elected in 2007 for his second and final term as the president of Kenya. Najua wengine ni wajana tu walizaliwa jana. Katiba hii tumekuwa tukipigania for 20 years